In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Poster Press to turn your designs and illustrations into authentic screen prints in Illustrator. The pack contains authentic textures from real printed ink, and I've turned these into a set of frame brushes and texture overlays. I've bundled these up into one click graphic styles to make them really quick and easy to use. And here's how you use them. Simply use the rectangle tool to create a rectangle roughly around the edge of your design. Then click on one of the styles from the graphic styles tab here. To change the style, simply click on another graphic style. And as you can see, I've supplied quite a range of looks and all of the effects can be edited after application. So for example, if you wanted to change the width of your border, all you have to do is adjust the stroke weight. So we could go for a thinner one or a really fat border. To change the color of the screen print effect, simply go to edit, edit colors, and just color balance. Then select color mode, click convert, and then adjust the sliders. Once you're happy with your color, simply click OK. You can adjust the frame color separately as well. So if you wanted to convert back to white, simply, simply select the stroke color here and then adjust the color sliders like so. To add extra depth to your image, you could also try layering different textures on top of each other. And to do this, you'll need to use the pattern swatches independently of the graphic styles. And you can find these on the swatches tab here. And as with most tabs, if you can't find it immediately available, it's here in the Windows menu. And so what I'm gonna do is draw another rectangle and then click on one of the swatches to apply it. And as you can see, that's really got a lot of texture going on there. And I'd like to add a bit of contrast. So I'm going to adjust the color of this second texture. So I'm gonna again go to edit, edit colors and adjust color balance. Now I'm gonna choose CMYK there, press convert and play around with the colors and just click the preview button there. And as you can see, you've got a really nice grungy look here and quite a lot of contrast. If you have any questions about the pack, please leave a comment below and I'll get back to you. Thanks for watching.